Hello, YouTube and Mr. Forks. Now, today we're going to be taking a look at changing folder icons because let's take a look at my applications folder. I've got lots of applications, but lots of these blank, boring folders. What is up with that, people? It just looks disgusting, let's be honest. Um, so, how can we go about correcting this? Now, it's pretty simple. Um, we're going to take Audacity as an example. We're going to right click, press in get info and then we're going to go into audacity and I am going to use this audacity icon if we go into this view it's easier to see it scales up quite large and will look nice on the folder so what we're going to do click on this info panel unlock it we need to authenticate and change everything to read and write just to make sure that you do have privileges and then drag the pro application, so I'm grabbing the audacity.app onto here, and you see this folder up here, we're going to let go. Boom! And now this folder looks pretty cool, we can lock that again. Um, now it won't update instantly on um, here, it might take a reboot, but in your actual applications folder it has automatically updated. There you go, Audacity, double click on there. We can still see it's a folder because of the drop down arrow next to it. And you can just work your way through um, doing it like that. It's really handy, and after you've done this to all your folders and you've rebooted, you know that it's going to look pretty nice. like that. I've had a couple of times where it's taken three or four goes to actually get it to work. I have no idea why that is, but sometimes it does. Um, as you can see, I've got it on my iWork folder, which makes it look a lot cooler. Um, and I've got numbers, pages, all that inside of this iWork folder. To get them to show up, how you to get the folders to actually look like folders here, um, what might happen is that you might have like something in there and it will display, it will look like that and that's not what iWork looks like so what you do, you right click and you press display as folder and that makes it look like a folder you want to do it for applications as well just another quick tip now if you actually want a custom icon then you will need to download a custom icon if you know how to create one, great if not, google it um, and just google the different ones, this iWork one I got off Deviant Art. Just Google that. I'm not going to provide a link because I'm um, lazy. So yeah, I think this was part of the icon that's in this folder. But yeah, no, that's just a quick tip. Um, hope you found it useful. I thought it was quite cool. And after I've rebooted my computer, it's going to look lovely. So I can just scroll through and see all just icons. So thank you for watching, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon.